Hi everyone, my name is Steph, this is Kidlit Joy, and today I'm here to share my review of When the World Was Soft Yinjibandi's Creation Stories by Jewelry Group Aboriginal Corporation. This is a really gorgeous graphic novel about five creation stories from the Pilbara region. They're stories that I had not heard before, and I was just absolutely so excited to read them. I've said this before and I love how a lot of the traditional Aboriginal stories are now being recorded so that people can access them and read them and learn more about the history of Australia through these stories because creation stories vary slightly between the different Aboriginal groups across Australia of which there are many and these stories have always been passed down verbally from elders to the younger generation but to also now have recorded copies of them in different formats as well is so important and the thing that I loved about this book because I'm, I'm not I'm not going to review the stories themselves because that is not my place these are stories that have been passed down for generation to generation and I found them so fascinating to read because many of these versions of the stories I've not read I was just totally immersed in the way that this book has been put together I think it is a really wonderful collection and I think the way that it incorporates graphic novels and illustration styles and traditional artwork and photographs of the region where these stories are from is just really clever. As I said, you do have traditional Aboriginal artwork and there is information about the artists who created it. There are photographs of the different places where these stories take place as well as some information about the Jullaroo group and the way that this book came to be produced. And then you have the five creation stories that are included told in a graphic novel format. And these have been illustrated by Alex Mankiewicz. So there is just so much in here to explore and unpack and to sit with. I probably need to do a few more readings to fully understand the, these stories and the implications of them, but they were so interesting and so insightful because all of these creation stories are directly related to a part of Australia and specifically to the group which might live in that part of Australia as well. And I just, I love reading these stories because it gives me more perspective, more understanding, and ultimately I think helps me to be a better ally. And I can always improve in that area. So this was great. It's probably aimed at more older middle grade, early young adult readers, just in terms of being able to read it independently. But gosh, it was just a really wonderful experience reading it. And I'm so very grateful to Alan Nunwin for sending it to me. In the comments, if you are planning on picking up when the world was soft, feel free to let me know. Or if you have other indigenous graphic novels from anywhere in the world, feel free to let me know because I'm always on the lookout for more recommendations. If you wanna let me know that you're here but you don't wanna leave a comment, feel free to leave a moon emoji down below. Otherwise, I hope that wherever you are in the world, you're staying safe and healthy and I will see you in my next video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye everyone.